Hi, welcome to this brand new system, 6.4.1, and uh, we have an issue. Well, the issue is because we have a new Vivaldi update, and I'm going to make a try to explain to you how and why we can fix it. So, AUR, Vivaldi, there is an update. It just came in at the same time we launch. That's how it happens always. So if you go view changes, three hours ago, Black Eagle has launched 1.14.177 and so on. You can see it here as well. So we got this update in. So 1.14.177.41, correct. And the dash tool, we don't see that. So anyway, you see down here on my button, everything is up to date. Um, so yes, I've got the latest and the newest Vivaldi in. We can check this here as well. So correct, 7741, yes, that's correct. Now, the issue is that this one is still the old version, is still the version from the previous Vivaldi. So doesn't really bother us, but if you go to, for instance, uh, the website YouTube and you watch a video, then you get this at some point in time. Oh, no, not this time. You get this. Well, that's it. So this is not the image you would like to see when you go and watch your YouTube. And there are other elements like Gmail. If you go to your Gmail, it's the same. Uh, you see this, this, that squirrel or whatever it is and then you just click in here and bam done so how can we fix this and i track the problem down that's what you need to do to track the problem down and say hmm so vivaldi got an update and the result so something else concerning vivaldi and that's support for videos like in youtube so this thing here, Vivaldi Codex FF MPEG Extra Pin. So this one has an old version, 63, and we need to get a new version. But the maintainer will probably do it in 2-3 days, but uh, why not just investigate and try if we can make it ourselves. So this thing will be updated, problem solved. But what if? Can we do this? So back to Vivaldi, it is working, no problem there, but it crashes on some sites. So AUR, Vivaldi, let's go back, because we need to check out what's happening. So this is going to be a tutorial actually on building, on package building. So if this is going to be too technical, just wait and everything will be just fine. But we're going to investigate what's going on. So Vivaldi is a new one. It's coming from Black Ike Eagle, but the other one is coming from somebody else. So if it would be from the same one, it would be updated instantly. This is another maintainer who has not yet updated it. So let's see if we can update it. That's the thing. All right, let's download the snapshot. So we're going to make a package of our own. As always, this is a clean installation, so I have to set some stuff here from time to time. Let's keep that open, but let's put it on the other screen. Downloads, Vivaldi Codex, right mouse click, extract here. This is not necessary, and that's what we need to have. Let's put it like so. That's our package built. Um, maybe, I don't know if it's going to look better, but I'm going to try anyway to see if we can get it in a more colorful way. Helps us to show that it's much more colorful, like so. Okay, yes, I want to do that. Welcome guys, no, bye. And that's it. So we have here Vivaldi Codex FM Pech Extra Bin coming from Fahad Hossein. And there's a package version and so on and so on. And I started to study the code. So there's an URL, packages, artful, chromium codex and extra downloads. There's a source that's coming from a Debian file from Ubuntu 17.10. There's a sum check. So you start reading the elements. So next up, 
let's see if what we get if we surf to this one chromium brass a lot of elements that we need but let's do this here my god come on that one there that one there let's make that one bigger Not too big otherwise I can't read so there are package versions and what we do is we download something which is called a chromium codex fmpeg and so on so chromium you scroll down scroll down scroll down and you are going to download ffmpeg 64 now it's not 64 now it's 63 so that's a number that exists and it's up here there so that's one of those but we want another one we want the newest one we want the 64 why do i need the 64 i need the 64 about here it says that the chrome user agent is 6403282 about version okay so one of those uh-huh now what did he download that's the question so we need to change this anyway let's start editing so 64 o 32 a2 all right 119 so that's one of those from here till here i'm not sure which one but 17.10 is defined somewhere else I thought but let's have a look so package release 2 so in this case that's that's 2 probably so there is no 2 so I'm gonna edit this as 1 and save it all right let's go ahead and read some more so it's going to download package version indeed it's going to look for 17.10 so now we're narrowing it down it's going to be this one since we want amd 64 and it's version 1 17.10 then this is the package release which is number one we just filled in up on the top this is amd 64 dep that's good package version is the one we wrote all the way up so 64032821192 so we're getting this one that's the one we're going to download okay now i should download probably because next up download complete that's fast all right um let's see if we can go to the file manager and downloads so that's the thing i downloaded no nope. that's the thing i downloaded okay he wants to be sure that it's the correct one so md5 sums is a way to check if the download is successful and correct and not tempered in any way so i'm gonna use my system to tell figure it out Control shift c and put it in here Control v save all right so far so good that seems all logical i didn't see what's happening inside this thing this thing is the install codec around uh, webpack and the original codec and backing up installing also looks like just checking and making backups that's this line i think we can give it a go a swirl maybe it works maybe it, it will not work so we are here in my downloads folder this is the snapshot i got from Vivaldi Codex and I'm gonna say make the package and we have one or more files that did not have went through so this one is actually coming from that line MD5 sums so something is not right I did not do something correctly indeed I don't know what I downloaded but the package build is downloading this one which is the correct version and Ubuntu 17.10 and 64 
So whatever I downloaded earlier on was not the, the right one, since we have a completely different and the five sum, control shift C and control V. That's a completely different number altogether. So giving it a try again. No, that's not whatever I want. So in here, make package. Oops. That's better. We're starting. Oh, it's done already. Is it? Damn. So, okay, we have now this package here, and we should try it out if it will work. Pamek is already running. Are you Pamek? So, it might be that it is indeed running. Let me check. Okay, instead of double clicking, I've now typed in sudo pacman minus u, the Vivaldi codex, this one up here. And I don't think Pamek is going to be voila, complaining. So, that's done. We have now installed a new version 64032821191 1. And let's have, see if it works. So, um, let's get rid of Vivaldi. Let's get that down, that down, that down. Get rid of that and test it out. So, restart Vivaldi and go to YouTube. Take one of the videos, see if it breaks down. And I guess let's wait for the advertising. Voilà. Everything seems to work. And there is those that are that will, there are Rocco and Ryan. Alright, so everything is working just fine. Um testing it some more, but I guess we fixed it. Alright, enjoy.